All right. What are we doing today, Kenmore? Well, today we're going to go and uh, salvage some Zetaprolinate from this wreck. Um, I have been mapping Yela, is what I've been doing with most of my time in game recently. Um, for no real reason other than to, to try it out and see if it works. I haven't finished the map yet, and I don't know if it'll work out, but uh, I'll show you what that means in a minute. So it's an excuse to go down to the surface of Yela um, and find the location of a wreck. This one should be a Starfarer, not one of the new ones, although I was hoping to get one of the new Caterpillar wrecks with the traversal puzzles in it. Maybe next time. I'm also flying keyboard and mouse today because my Thrustmasters are giving me trouble. One of them is fine, but the other one has got that thing going on where um, it's constantly giving a rotational input, even if you're not doing it. Anyways, it's just a known issue with Thrustmasters. I'm not that mad about it, because I got mine at Walmart on clearance. So you can see here that I am at a an outpost. Just by dead reckoning, looks like the closest outpost to the wreck that I'm going to. And then I am taking the headings to other outposts. So this one is at about uh, more or less 274. I think it's okay if it's within a degree or not, or two. And then what I'm doing is I'm creating these little shapes in this uh, this app that I have, and where they intersect is, you know, but when I map enough of these, get enough of these headings, then they should sort of all line up so I can figure out what the, the relationship is between each of the locations. And then I can start filling in things like Rex. All members of oh. the civilian defense force. This is Special Agent Rowena Vicky Attache for the CDF. The UEE Navy is in urgent need of assistance. All right, and as you can hear, Xenothread is on, but we are not doing that. Uh, I am going to finish doing this. I don't have anything that's particularly combat capable. Engines offline. So I'm not sure if there's going to be anybody in this wreck. So. I'm going in armed, minimally armed. I'm gonna go slow until I decide it's safe. Is that anything? No. Looks empty. There's one upstairs here. Also no. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. And I thought I brought a tractor beam, but I didn't. Alright, load you up and then bring you to Breaker's Yard. Alright, so that's our four Zeta Prolinade. Time to take off, and that's on Selen, I think. No, Damer. Zip on in here and go into uh, Bri Brio's breaker yard or whatever. I haven't started mapping Damer, so I don't have to take headings when I get there. Beautiful day for it, though. down close so that it's not a very long walk. Oh, and uh, see that little turret out there. Hmm. Alright, oh, some weird stuff going on with my screen in the dark here. Number two. So as you can see, uh, I tried this multiple times. This is sped up four times. I don't know how many times I tried, but okay. Eventually it worked. The next box, I had no such luck. 
This is sped up eight times, and my timer just kept running down. And if the fourth box is like this, even if this one gets taken, if the fourth box is like this, it's going to explode in my hands. So I got uh, very frustrated with this. All right. Well, to hell with that. This is going to explode anyways. I'm not making any money off this. One and two. Time to test this gun. <laughs> I totally didn't expect them to actually explode like that. Wow. Wow. One bug leads me to discover a new bit of fidelity, I guess. And uh, for good measure, you know what? I'm gonna express myself. All right, well, so much for that. Thanks for watching anyways. Uh, hopefully next week I'll be back with another uh, talk video, if not uh, the one after. This has been taking a lot longer than I expected, so um, have a good week, and I'll see you next time, whenever that happens to be.